It's really important because your voice matters. It's not just like, oh, vote because vote. It's like, we care about what you feel. Oh. Hi. Hi. If you were talking to someone and they're thinking, I don't know if I'm going to vote. I don't know, you know, what the issues are, if it matters, will it matter? What would you say to them? I'd probably say that I, I, I understand the initial feeling of that because, of course, as, you know, our little people that we are, you know, we don't think of ourselves as really mattering. I just think that that makes sense for one second and then just think about it a little harder and you can see that that's not how it works and that you really do matter and everyone is just one person. So, you know, if everybody had the same mindset of, oh, it doesn't matter that I do it, then it's like, then everybody's not doing it. So, right. and it's really important because your voice matters. It's not just like, oh, vote because vote. It's like, we care about what you feel. I totally agree with you. Like your voice, if you use it, whoever you are, is very powerful. And so you've got to know the power that you possess and don't let anyone ever take you out the game. And during election time, one of your powers is to use your voice by voting. Don't ever let any situation or anyone make you feel small yes. or make you feel like you don't matter. Everything should be like that. You should yeah, never that's right. ever let anybody tell you that your voice doesn't matter and your feelings don't matter. I want to talk with you about how are you thinking about the climate crisis? You know, we're just running out of time at this point. And even if we did something drastic now, it's still cutting it really close. And that on its own is a terrifying thought, but it's like you, you just can't deny science. The earth is precious to us. It's the only reason we're here, as we all know. And if we don't protect it and take care of it and love it and nurture it, then it's just... Yeah. It's not, we're gonna die, first of all, and it's a lot to unpack, but um, it is really important. That's a great point that you're making. Like the clock is ticking on this thing and we need to have timelines. You know, Joe and I talk about the timelines that we have for carbon neutral, for net zero in terms of emissions and greenhouse gas emissions, you know, and an in, in investment in, in what we think about infrastructure to capture and store water, in California, so many other places, this is a big issue. But we have to have the right leadership in place and and activists and everybody's gotta vote. Gotta vote, gotta speak up, gotta listen and... What, mom? Gotta vote for <laughs> <I'm gonna laughs> her. Hi, mom, I, let's see, where's mom? Let me say hi. 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 So, thank you, Senator. <laughs> How are you? I'm um, good. We she, are, she just whispered, you gotta vote for them. <laughs> <laughs> gotta vote for Biden and Harris. Yes, vote for Biden and Harris. <laughs> Yay, go Biden and Harris. Yes, thanks the planet. Bye, Mom. Bye. <laughs> oh, look at that nice fade out.